Welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some discard burn. Been a little bit since we've played Jinx Draven Aggro and just a Jinx deck in general. So we're going to go ahead and try this one out. Um, I've been seeing it played against me a decent amount here recently and it's been looking pretty good. Basically we're trying to be as aggressive as possible and go wide on the board and be re rewarded for discarding stuff. We're going to be discarding cards like Jury Rig and Flame Chompers. And those will be able to just get on the board. And we want to go wide. We have House Spider here too. And we have the rewards for going wide are Arena bat Battlecaster. Attack, give other battling allies plus one plus zero. And then Crowd Favorite. That we can hopefully make some very large crowd favorites. Uh, so that's what we got going on. Uh, lots of ways to discard. Draven's biggest fan. Pretty important here because we do really want Draven every single game. It's going to be an important card with Spinning Axe. Um, also, I guess going wide is Vision. So Spinning Axe plus Vision, that's a great combination as well. Another uh, reward for discarding. All right, so let's give this a try. Discard Burn. We're going to go play uh, five games in ranked. Playing some aggressive decks today. We just had Spider Aggro, Twisted Fizz. Um, now we got this, and then we're going to play some Darius Thresh. Why is it that whenever we play the deck that goes wide, we get paired against Twisted Fate? Maybe they don't have Twisted Fate. You know, maybe they won't have Twisted Fate red card. That's possible, right? All right, so I want so I know Draven's super important, but I was gonna mulligan Draven since our Draven's biggest fan was just gonna draw it for us anyway. Um, you know, it's it's the same thing. Hey. So you know, like we draw the random card instead of. That being Draven. Same kind of thing anyway. Draven, Get him, Draven. Unfortunately, that probably means they're going to be having a spell to kill Draven now. Just going to keep it like that. Not going to use Vision yet. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Do you know how to make Petty Officer better? You know, three mana Petty Officer. What if what if Petty Officer just got three bodies? What if it made a 2-2 two, two, and a 2-1 one, and a 1-1? One, one? I don't really feel like we need to use the Flame Chompers yet. So if I would have done Flame Chompers, I guess I would have made this thing a 6-5. Right, so they're at 9. There we go, that's a good draw. I rarely forget oh, I guess I can't play that. And play uh, Augmented Experimenter. Which I want to play the Augmented Experimenter. Alright, maybe I just don't play Augmented Experimenter and just play this instead. I'm at eight. That's scary. Uh, 
in time. There's plenty of killing there. The other problem here is we, we know we're drawing Draven, but I can't go Draven and Augmented Experimenter. Do I wait yet another turn on Experimenter? No, probably not. I guess I'd just discard Draven. Lots of jinx. Gotta go with the flow. I don't necessarily have to challenge the powder keg. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna challenge the powder keg. Who's that you got there? Ooh, down to two. Okay, Jinx, get excited next turn. I'm glad we didn't challenge the powder keg. Oh no, down to one. Oh, this could be rough. Hopefully this works. All right, GGS. I was so I was kind of confident that that would work because they didn't play any spells to get rid of their powder keg the previous turn and didn't use any removal. Ooh, got a mirror match. Well, this will be a coin flip. Get excited kills the champions. I wish I had like I wish I had something that we want to discard with this urchin. But I like I like everything in hand. I guess even if we don't, we want to get rid of our hand for Jinx anyway, so. Naturally. Un there's nothing wrong with just unloading the hand anyway of getting a leveled up Jinx. They go Draven, we'll go um, Sump Treasure. Yeah, we still kill Sump Treasure. Still a lot of damage coming in. I wish we had one mana, right? I wish we could play Jinx and Rummage this next turn. Cause I, I am worried about playing Jinx and then they have Get Excited and then they kill my Jinx. I'm worried about that. So maybe I just play Battlecaster and next turn go Jinx Rummage. I mean, I should, just pa I should just pass priority. That's probably what I should have done. We're gonna need Jinx to do a lot. We haven't really had anything else besides Jinx. Now we're cooking. I stand for Noxers. I gotta work with this Joker. <laughs> Give 
Alright, what else we got? Be easy. <laughs> Poro can discard that, then one, one, crowd favorite. Basically, I can I can play either Draven or crowd favorite. Well, I guess it's got to be Draven. Yeah, never mind. I guess it's got to be Draven. It's Draven time. Well, hey there, good looking. The answer is yes, somewhere. The team means they like you. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I guess I had to do Spinning Axe first. No. Because I wanted to do Spinning Axe on... I guess I just couldn't... I couldn't do anything about that. Because I wanted to go Spinning Axe on the fl on the Flame Chompers. And give it to be the one power, so then the one damage that this you would do across that would kill order. their crowd favorite. So I needed to combine those two. I needed to combine the spinning axe damage and the super mega death rocket damage. Oh, this game's just over. relying on Jinx with that hand. Hey, buddy. What you do? All right, down to two. I guess I could have made it down to three if I played the jury rig, but it's not going to matter. All right, they got the mirror match. So this is what losing feels like. Sucks. Probably what we needed to do. Oh no, another mirror match. All right, so this time we'll mulligan the top end cards like that and look for like the jury rigs. Like jury rig was awesome. Let's see. Okay, so yeah, like now we actually have payoffs for being discarded. So we'll see. Maybe I'm not supposed to keep vision. But right now I don't have a turn two play. Maybe I'm just overrating these get excited. You know, I just feel like get excited is important against these cards, but um, it didn't work out for me last game. Is he here yet? Oh, man. Yeah, man. I don't know if it's the same opponent or not. I don't know. Uh, yeah, okay. Great, then. Out. Maybe. I was definitely expecting them to play Draven there, and I was gonna play Get Excited if they played Draven, because you know we couldn't couldn't block Draven profitably. Probably just go rummage here and just discard both Flame Chompers and just get them in play. Draven time. Well, hey there, good looking. Okay, we could go for crowd favorite. Joker. Let's do this. If I fall, Sophie. 
You hoping they'll die of boredom? Alright, so I'm gonna use the spinning axe. Whether do we want to do I want to do do I want to have this thing be a four one or do I want to get more damage on them? I'm gonna get more damage on them. For the money makers. We'll have that be a four two and do one extra damage to them, especially with me having the Zonite Urchin. Uh, maybe I should have done four one because I have this Flame Chompers. Blinking sometime. <laughs> Ooh, that could be good. Rolling death. All part of the plan. I just made up. Like the fuse. That could be good. I didn't do nothing. See, I'm either casting get excited or whirling death, and I guess we do whirling death right now. This is gonna hurt for you. How is Draven not a bat battling ally? What's going on here? Alright, there we go. Alright, GG's. So, one and one against the mirror match. Makes sense. Damn, I'm good. Ooh, going deep. The deep deck does have the ability to put in good blockers. Mulligan, mulligan. Um, guess we keep Battlecaster. One drop. Not yet. Not sure if I'm supposed to mulligan Battlecaster or not. So they got Dead Bloom Wanderer. I'll go ahead and let them trade Dead Bloom Wanderer for Battlecaster if they want. Attacking with Battlecaster first, of course. Okay, they do not want to make that trade. Good to know. Going deep. That kind of pass is definitely usually like Jaw Hunters. Um. Alright, Malkai. So I could go biggest fan and battlecaster, or crowd favorite or Jinx. You hoping they'll die of boredom? Oh, do whatever they want. I'm gonna go with another battlecaster uh, and the two one. Alright, they gotta do some blocking. So they're gonna survive, but that's gonna kill Maokai. And now we'll, we'll play the Jinx. Rules are made. 
So fought through, you know, fought, fought through a Withering Whale and a 3-2 Lifesteal and a Maokai. Doing pretty good so far. No, it was, it was not the best to play crowd favor before attacks because of Maokai. I didn't want them just to be able to play any, you know, another like Dead Dead Bloom Wander or whatever, something else, and then they also get a, another free 2-1 attacking in as well. I said attack again, sorry, I meant blocking. It's another another free 2-1 to block. I didn't want them to have a free 2-1 to block. I gotta work with this joker. I guess we're really doing this. Alright, looks like we're really doing this. So vengeance for crowd favorites. Nope. All right, GGs. Three and one. All me, and maybe those other guys. Whatever. Ooh, straight up Noxus. Discard burn, looking pretty decent. All right, I'm gonna mulligan the battle casters. We'll keep the vision to go along with the urchin. Explosives primed. Anything else? <laughs> They'll never see it coming. I'm innocent. And I guess we just trade. Um, I don't know. I could also not trade, and then because just attack, just playing Battlecaster and attacking with Battlecaster does turn this Flame Chompers into a one-two, and the one-two can kill the Saboteur. So I've taken extra two damage here, which could be important in the world of racing. It's probably where we are. And a Grenadier, yeah, Grenadier trades, you know, two drops trade. You know, we're left with a 2-1 instead of an 0-2. gonna wait a turn. Probably going to be doing some kind of blocking, right? I don't know if I let them know. So the, the reason to do the rummage first would be finding like another attacker. They're probably going to be doing some kind of blocking. No. I guess not. No one's the wiser. Yeah, it got punished. Should should have done the double vision. Considering whether or not to block the precious pet, or how we're going to block precious pets. Got a rock with your name on it. Guess I'm not going to block precious pet. Could a hard could a hard cast a vision. To block, I just not really that interested in Draven getting into blocking. Nothing but Noxian might. Rules are made to be broken, like buildings or people. You should try blinking sometime. Who's a good hunker, John? Is 
They're down to five. There's good blocks by them. It's a good house spider. Remember the objectives. The few for the many. It's gonna be very close. Now it's a party. Alright, doesn't look so close anymore. I was going to say that. Going to have 15. Watch your step. 15 overwhelm. I stand for I'm gonna have eight defense. This, Joker. It's me taking seven. So I guess I need to block. I need to block that two one with my Draven, the precious pet. I you know definitely thought about it, and yeah, I, I wish I would have for how this played out for sure. You're starting to bore me. Hey, buddy, what you doing? Okay, so need to block the precious pet with the Draven. Didn't end up looking like they had anything that dealt one point of damage in their hands. And not only would that have saved me two so life, what feels like. which would have kept me alive there, but then also they would not have had the precious pet to be able to block my six power jinx the next turn. Then they wouldn't have had that, and that you know that six damage would have killed them also. All right, so I had to had to block the precious pet. All right, but there we go. There's there's discard a burn. Um, I I have to say I was pretty impressed with the deck. Uh, we went three and two. Could have maybe been a four-one there if I would have just made that block. Um, but very fast games and uh, look, the deck looked good. Um, played against a lot of similar decks. That's definitely like <laughs> really seems like that's what you get with, with Legends of Terror. We talked about this yesterday. We played the anti-burn deck yesterday and never got paired against burn. And yeah, now we play you know Noxus P and Z. We got paired against you know Noxus P and Z twice. Noxus another time. Noxus Bilgewater another time. Um, you know, that, that, that seems like that's what's going to... I don't know. That kind of feels like that's what happens, right? Like, whatever regions you play, you get paired against similar regions. But maybe maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's just small samples. All right, Discard Burn. Good one if you want a fast deck to rank up. Try it out. Those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there. And if, you've been, if you have been trying out discard burn or if you do leave those comments let me know what you think of the deck um you know any other comments what do you think about the new cards any questions about the new cards uh any uh anything that you want to see on stream anything like that love seeing those questions but anyway thank you so much for watching some discard burn and i'll see you for the next video